Hello, YouTube. Welcome on back. Good to have you here. Um, do I dare settle this city? Does it get insta-raised? It seems pretty ballsy. And then we kind of want to start pointing at Rome. I kind of I kind of need some help. It's a man at arms, right? Like if I just settle that city, we're probably in trouble. Um, I want the Saguba here, Holy Site here, probably. Just a theater square there to lock it in. Seems okay. I could buy it a unit, yeah. We've got we've got plenty of faith. In fact, I should be Am I faith buying a bunch of banks? I would do that if we were uh owls. That wasn't really my plan for here though. Yeah, I, I wish we had Valletta. Man, Vatican City solid too. Thank you, Daddy. Yeah, it's good. Uh, it's good to be back. This is a great one. We're just getting all the merchants. Like no one's even. No one's even looking at him. I wish we had won that Congress. Galley's probably dead. Yeah. That's okay. It's just a galley. You're curious about what you're doing with this settler there, buddy. This cavalry has made us over a hundred gold. Over. Yeah, losing the siege here is a bummer. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to hit in here. I probably am still. It just it just makes me very vulnerable to this trebuchet. Oh yeah, I was supposed to go to the man at arms. So that city's gonna be pretty good pretty fast. Hello, Scythia. Yeah, it's a pretty good Petra. I can't com complain about it. Deal? We're approaching another golden, so that's good. I probably don't need the circumnavigate then. That's the day we stop exploring. 
Hey. Oh, that kind of makes our... Mm, not that much worse. We lose one tile. It's actually really nice for us. Oh, did we uh, Did we maybe lose that... Uh, yeah, that man-at-arms. Cool. Turned into a city-state. That works for me. I realize this isn't the cheapest, but I think it's okay to do. We're getting culture from it. All right, we're done with that. I'm done making units for a little while, actually. Raid might be okay to have. So what do we want? I'm gonna need some builders. Diplo League is not doing much. Public and Legacy. It's not great right now. My settlers had a good example for them. <laughs> nice. All right, I guess this is not doing anything again, which is weird. Okay, um, can I take the city, please? Bum ba -da bum Tamanaki. There's already a builder there. You get a builder. And you get a builder. Can you get a builder? Can you get a builder? All right. Next thing is Rur now, right? I think. Yeah, it could be time for peace. Thank you, Ironside. It's good to be back. I got an Aqueduct here and not feel particularly ashamed about it. I've been missed. Aw, that's really nice. I've missed. I've missed you all for sure. For sure. We'll buy them stuff soon, I guess. 300 gold per turn is nice. All right, and then we have another governor title, which does matter. We did just finish the audience chamber. Magnus for growth in the Petra city? Aw, thank you. Thank you, Imperator. That's so nice of you guys. Thank you. The other thing that we're not doing, which I would normally love to do with Coupe, or with, with Coupe, <laughs> other than murder him, um, with Mansa, is get to like Contractor or Divine Architect on these, but it's so far. Probably Reyna is worth. But I'm also thinking uh, just Magnus and Surplus Logistics start growing that Petra city, right? Like I'm not even using it for the chops necessarily. But the growth seems so relevant to me. It's weird to not use Magnus for chops, but whatevs. Are you killing them? Oh, yeah. See that? You're not allowed to do. All right. So what do I want from Rome? 
What do you have? Just a galley. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten cities. I don't want to lose them. <laughs> I appreciate you, Ironside. Do I want all of his cities? Kind of. I don't see Rome proper. Um, I, I like great library. He's got a couple campuses, which are oddly placed. Shocker. Um, as is this theater square, but um, you know, honestly, like picking him up with Colosseum is mostly free. You have that Petra. Makes sense to do whatever you can. Yeah, agreed. Because they only have seven population, right? I mean, I, I will get this aqueduct pretty quick. But I do think we can just kind of turn... Heal up, turn our attention north, and go work on Rome. Nice thing about fighting Rome... There's Rome proper. Um, nice thing about fighting Rome is he uh, builds walls for you. Or builds roads for you. All right, I'm just going to take this then. So, eight era score needed. <laughs> exactly, Ionic. Uh, I want to settle more uh, marsh city. I just want to, like, settle more cities. We have the faith per turn to do it, so. Jury, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I don't want to sell more iron. Yeah, this, this is not acceptable, Rome. If anything, I need to war him just to save them. That's so, we're getting so much value. This is back to A to Z. This is back to our marathon. Back to our regularly scheduled marathon. Booyah, min maxed. Single Envoy does what? Not a lot. Uh, they have to, like, be mine. Some of the Cassiuses are weird to me still. I'm with ya, Ayane. Um. My man. Man, can I save this city state or no? Uh, I don't think we're doing culture victory. That's not my current plan anyways. I don't know if he'll move off the city-state if I declare or not. I'll chop that. 
Can I ask some dumb questions? Very enthusiastic Civ player, but big noob. Absolutely. I love questions. I love to teach the game. So, yeah, your questions are more than welcome here. Do not be shy. Go explore this. Yeah, I, I honestly like what as we explored the map, I was like, oh, Lady of the Reeds and Marshes is legit on this map, like actually legit. So it's kind of a weird one. Thanks in the city with the 66 turn theater score. What's the point of that? Um, you mean 60, Everything like what's the point of the 66 turns? Um, uh, like this one that I'm working on. I just didn't have anything else for them to do at the time. Uh, and I couldn't give them anything else. So there's literally nothing else for them to really work on. That'll shorten as they grow and get better population. Or if I get them a builder, right? The builder helps a lot. Uh, but you can quicken that up by chopping or whatever else. Like, it'll eventually be a thing. And this is a city that I'm going to build um, St. Basil's. So that's where I want my theater square to go anyways. Uh, M. Chilbert, thank you for the five months. And uh, Box, thank you for the brand new Prime. I missed that. Oh, my gosh. Thank you for the follow and the sub. I'm getting a little spacey. I've been streaming a while now today. So it'll eventually be a thing. I, I agree it looks weird. It definitely looks weird. Uh, but St. Basil's will make that city really solid. It's a really good Petra. It is a really good Petra. Oh, Jebel's still available too. I don't really want to Jebel on top of my... What if I Jebel right here? It's five cities, and I could throw another one down here, technically. Let's start moving the battering ram. I've built it a couple times, but mostly you have to. That's a wonder that you have to steal. Agreed. Imagine a vampire castle with this Petra. Yeah, <laughs> pretty pretty good. We did have a Jebel picked out, but then we district. Di oh, I guess we did have this. But this is a four city Petra or four city Jebel. I do have the chops for it here, which is interesting. And then it gets better if I do this, but this is kind of a stupid city, right? It does get a decent, like, you know, a couple decent districts. And then that. I kind of like it here, given that I'm already planning to build my theater square here for them. And I could still do the same thing. One, two, three, four, five, six. I could actually settle this. Yeah, I think I'm going to jebel here. I don't have chops for it which is I guess there's one yeah we definitely did pin that but I, I I'm not I, I don't need to be married to that at all this was we are thinking about Zimbabwe here but it's not even that good of a Zimbabwe honestly because we got rid of all the copper So what do I want from them? I got Aqueduct Industrial. It's pretty solid. Hits several cities. I guess just a campus. This is a very good campus, yeah?
Big Ben is a great thing to plan around for. Yeah, we should definitely think about Big Ben. And this could be a solid city for it, given uh, given the chops. But yeah, so we'll keep an eye on the city as we go. Did you have other questions, or were you just kind of confused by my, uh, my, my weird theater square? <laughs> Which I totally understand. All right, second promo. This definitely goes to surplus logistics so that we can grow here. The aqueduct will help, but we need housing pretty bad. Pretty bad style. It's going to get frisky with Rome. I have to decide right away. If he raises Chinguetti, I'm going to be sad. I'm going to be super sad. can cool it on builders and put something more useful here. We do use mods, yeah, exclamation point mods if you wanna see the list. Please don't kill them. All right, here I think we make peace. I, I don't even know where Coupe's other cities are. He does have a few. Um, It's not a lot of gold, but we get the whales and we just make peace with him. I think that's fine. Please don't kill them. All right. I steal his settler, though. So it's happening. It is going down. For better or for worse. Hey, we do get the protector at war. Because, yeah, because they were allied to me. I don't know that I've ever clicked that button before. That's pretty sweet, though. That's perfect. It's thematic and everything. All right, now we got to be on our uh, toes a little bit. Oh, I bought this settler. I was like, where did I get this settler from? We'll need some siege units. Yeah, pretty likely. Pretty likely that we will.
So we just halved that time, yeah? I don't have a tier 2 government building yet, no. I think I can really buy with faith is like a bank or two. I don't really have that. Alright, please don't raise them. Please. Oh, right. <laughs> I'm sorry, dear scout. I may have signed your death warrant. <laughs> Oops. We lose Leventa. Where do we want this to go? Seems good. Although they grab these tiles. I hate doing that. What's up, Papa Poodlin? What, what, what's going on? All right. Oh, they got kicked out. All right. That's a start. Not going to be a finish, though. All right, where's this city go? Probably backtracks a bit. Bought me a turn, yeah. Again, I just really don't want them to get raised. If they get taken over, we can we can solve that. Don't really know. I don't have a plan of attack at the moment. My my army's a bit haphazard. All over the place. Alright, well that's ballsy. Let's do it. And then all glory to the Petra City. Trade enhancement mod, such a blessing, yeah, for sure. For sure. Yeah, crossbows aren't too far away. We could certainly grab them. Apostle's been doing a whole lot of nothing. <laughs> Whose territory was this? Why didn't you scout? Embarrassing. He's got a pretty massive army. I'm definitely poking the bear. I'd love to pillage this. Okay. Didn't get raised. That's huge. Oh boy, I do want the gold, um, especially since these aren't great. Building Forbidden City for me, how nice of him. 
That's very thoughtful. Does he have a religion? No. That's true, as long as my cavalry are around my trade routes, so trade routes won't get pillaged anyways. That's a very good point. I like need to assemble. I need some siege units. Again, I really wish we had won that Congress. Turns on their aqueduct and then we get Jebel going. It's really late for Jebel. It is pretty unlikely that we're gonna actually get it. Um, I mean, I guess I'm building this. I'd almost rather just run commercial hub stuff and buy things. I'm building an industrial zone. Am I feeling well? I mean, I don't feel good about it. I wonder if this is correct. We're rich. like a pretty massive city. Yeah, crossbows would be very nice. You're going there. This is going to go over here. They have tons of food, though. They'll grow. They'll grow. Raid may, might be nice. Raid is probably better than this. Could have done it before that. Oops. This is the Zimbabwe city. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Technically eight if I keep that, but I think I'd rather have the plus seven campus. Okay. But does it have to be on a river? Did I screw up my positioning now? Because does, doesn't Zimbabwe have to be... Must be built adjacent and adjacent to cattle. Okay, no, it doesn't have to be on a river. It can go right here. Perfect. Okay. Deal. Deal. 
Trading great works awful or okay. It's fine. I do it. <laughs> I, I I have weird, weirdly specific rules about what I'm willing to exploit and what I'm willing to not. Uh, trading great works is definitely one that I'm willing to do because it uh, it just speeds up your game if you're doing tourism stuff or slows down their game. And they, they, that is true, too. They are usually not cheap. Thirteen available housing here is not too bad. spot. All right, does this city go here? It goes there. Yeah, Mausoleum City's on my list here. Might be a good Mausoleum City. Oh, that's actually a fair point. That's a very fair point. Let's make a Mausoleum City here. Good call. Good call. Hey, what do you want? What I would like to do is take Antium and then start using his encampments for my units. You realize I wasn't building enough stuff, so you're restarting your first game. Expand your city, your expand your empire. Like settlers are are kind of the the thing that you need the most of early on. Uh, builders will be your most built unit in every single game, uh, but settlers are the most important. Pop 15 capital. With more to go. You love to see it. Love that I've got them back. So much faith. Let's go down here. Got our golden age secured. Love to see that. It's our next district here. Oh, 
Also, I need to unlock this, uh... Need to unlock this. Soon enough. So I guess we get the holy site first. This is production. All right, and this city goes here. I think we said. Hello. He's bringing his units to say hello. Oh, that was a builder. <laughs> That's not my intention. Yeah, so let's make this coastal and do the, uh... By a general, that's true Renaissance Industrial. Like, it, it doesn't actually help me. It's a good thought. Oh, and I don't even want this. I want the Jebel, right? Let's do that. Casually settling, warring building. <laughs> uh, it's it's fun. I like Civ Six. Kind of a fan of this game. Wrong spot. Needed to go up one more. Uh, I don't think so. This hits this, 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 and this. And could hit something else down here as well. Could it hit the harbor city? One, two, three, four, no. I need to go up one more to get all the fishing boats. I can't though. It's in his city range. This is the only spot I could. So yeah, I don't. I don't get this. Oh, I suppose I could have gone here. Eh. It's okay. We'll live. But yeah, you're you you're right. You're right. I could have I could have gotten uh two more fishing boats. This is a bit of a mistake. But this gives us the chop, so I don't know. But you're definitely right. Hundred percent. Mostly I just want the mazel. Like, mostly I just want the effect. But could have been min-maxed. And now I'm Sag. No, is it? I just didn't look. When I start to man it. <coughs> when I start to manage this many things at once, my 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 willingness to micro goes down. Right? Like I just I start to go like okay whatever, because at some point our economy is going to be so good that it doesn't matter. But anyways, speaking of things that are so good that they don't matter, uh, well, you matter, YouTube, and I love you. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you. Uh, I will see you soon.